closer to be viewers it's another suit time and today i'm back to introduce what's on my desk and like what's in the study area of my room i recently got a new desk and a new bookshelf from ikea so then i wanted to do this like what's on my desk kind of tour while it's still clean and everything is really organized in my room and i got a bunch of new stuff so i wanted to show what it looks like and what my space what my study area looks like in my room um so yeah i hope you enjoy this what's on my desk tour and let's get started okay so this is what my desk area looks like so i recently got a new desk and because i wanted some more storage inside like here and stuff so let me just go around what's on top so i don't really like having a lot of things on top of my desk so i kept the top like very simple so i have my laptop that's on the side and this laptop holder actually came broken so then i tried to refund it and amazon said that i could just like keep it and they'll just refund the money for me so then i got the refund but until i get a new one i'm just using this as a temporary and this is another uh crystal no not crystal like acrylic clear pencil case that i got from amazon and basically has like four pockets and these are all the pens and pencils and like markers and like sharpie stuff that i use most of the time on a daily basis so i have that and right next to it is where I keep my like eraser, whiteout, and like post it, and like a couple of like white index cards. And then this is a phone holder that I got from YesStyle actually. So this also could bolt in like this, so I could just like carry it around with me. And I could just open it up like this. And then it also actually goes higher. So yeah, it's very, very nice and actually fits my iPad as well. So that's nice. And you can recognize this. I have Joanne's cup that she made me for my birthday. And then on this side, I bought this book holder, this book stand so I could use it for my textbooks. But I don't really use like physical textbooks anymore that much. So I just decided to put this journal that I have for my art therapy class and my ipad on this because i use my ipad a lot so then i just leave it on this corner of the desk so i could just grab it at any time so that's on that corner and i have my pencil case that i carry to school so this is like pencil case that i would just carry it out when i go to school and stuff it's really big i also got this from yes style and this is my 100 day bible reading plan that we're doing at a church and right next to the desk actually i have this red cabinet that somebody just gave it to me because they were moving and each of these cabinets have like different things so i'm not really gonna go through them but yeah and then on top i have like some art supplies right now because i'm in an art therapy class so we do a lot of like art experiments and inside this is where i keep my other laptop my lenovo laptop my wallet stays in here and just ruler extra, extra document and this another acrylic like like divider holder thing i got from marshall's because it was on sale because it had a little crack so yeah and this is where i keep all my additional stuff that i don't want to keep on the desk so i just put it in here so i have like stapler tape um lead usb in there is just more storage stuff i have like some apple pen uh tip and my scissor tape and i keep all my cocoa stickers inside there so it's all there there's a pen set from korea and all my post-its that i have here and then on this drawer this is where i have my other stuff so like my techie stuff i guess so i have the tape dispenser stapler and some extra batteries and i have a clipboard I have some like earphones, these are like the USB-C port converter, this is the remote for my projector and my mouse, and this keyboard is a keyboard that I actually got from Korea, but I lost the box, so I didn't want it to be just like hanging out, hanging out in the open space, because this didn't look pretty and neat, so I just stuffed it in here, it fit perfectly, and I also have my two AirPods in there. 
So in terms of the dust area, that is what it looks like. And I guess underneath, uh, this is the small bookshelf I used to have before I bought my other bookshelf. So that's the current textbook that I'm using for my research methods class. I also have a yoga mat in there and this coffee cup trash bin. So I have that. And I have a heater like right underneath my desk so it keeps me very warm. So this is what my desk looks like. Okay, so moving on to the bookshelf area. This is what the bookshelf looks like. It's literally right next to my desk. So start from the top. I have some notebooks here that I use for when I study for MCAT. And I have my lamp over there. And this is the karaoke mic. And I have the Bluetooth mic, I have Bluetooth keyboard that Joanna Susan got me. And this box here is uh, for all the cards that I receive. So I really like um, receiving handwritten cards. So I keep all of them in this box. And I like to open it sometimes and just reread what people just sent me and stuff. So I have paper clips down here. So I like to keep my hair out of the way when I'm studying. And this is where I just print out all my syllabus stuff and just clip it on the side. So on the first shelf, this is where the this is all the smaller size books. So all these books are used the ones that I used to read back in high school. And then my glasses and like Carmax here that I could just use when my lips just get happy. I have my model kit stuff for Orgo. I have my dissection kit that's on the top there and some printer ink. So yes. And then on the second shelf, I can't really see, but I have all sorts of like color printer paper that's there that I use sometimes. And this is a label maker that our youth pastor actually gave to me and my little sister. And these are just additional like medium sized books that I also used to read back in high school. And then oh, I also have my calculator here. And down here on the third floor, third floor lol third shelf is where all the binders and folders and like the um previous like past semester notes are so i have all my binder stuff and extra loose leaf and stuff like that all here and this is where i keep all my mcat books and like mcat prep stuff like that so yeah this is what this area looks like it's literally straight next to my desk and I have a printer on the side right here. So, so I could just grab things very easily when it prints out from my laptop. And yeah, so this is what the shelf looks like. Okay, I hope you enjoy this desk tour and I guess what's, a bit, what's around my desk with the bookshelf and the red cabinet. Uh, so maybe Susan and Joanne could do this on their own time if they're willing to share how uh, their study area looks like so until the next vlog until the next video stay safe stay healthy and yeah bye